Have you ever dreamed of taking a long break from your hectic life, maybe even quitting your job and go on an epic journey such as an Africa safari where you can forget all your worries, not just being a tourist, but to create art at the same time. So you come back with not just an experience, but also taking photos that truly represents your feeling. I finally made that happen. Here is a photo of a lion roaring under a storm. Here the sun burst through the cloud for a few seconds when this lion looked into our direction. I have a shot I always dream to get, which is when two male lions bump head with each other. It's a special ritual that shows their strong bonding. Male lions sleep most of the day, and they only do this ritual after they wake up. And the head bump lasts for less than one-tenth of a second. It's very difficult to get the perfect clean background without tall grass blocking their heads and to get in the right position so that both of their heads are parallel to the camera. I have tried it many times and failed. Stay till the end of the video to see if I can get it in this trip. Starting the game drive early is the key because lions tend to be more active before sunrise. Also, the light would be better in early morning. We drove to these big rock formation called Kopis, but didn't have any luck. Hello, morning. How nice it would be if they stand on the rocks like Lion King. Dula, my guide, suggests we drive further because the day before we saw three male lions sleeping in the tall grass there. Maybe this time we get lucky and they will be out. It's been raining and the road was flooded. Riding on it is like riding the Indiana Jones ride in Universal Studio. But this time, we are in reality, like in Jurassic Park. Wait. Alright, I'm just doing everything. I held dear to my life because I could be flown out of the vehicle into the mud, or worse, into a lion crowd. <laughs> the place is about two hours away. I look out at the distant sky and it looks so dark, a bit scary. It's just us. For some reason, we didn't see any other vehicle in the whole area. We drive around where we saw them the day before, but we couldn't find them. Oops! The iconic hat! Can do it! Yeah! One, two, four, five! I flew to 10 miles away. <laughs> yeah. After an hour's search, it starts to rain. The rain gets heavy. Since we are at an open vehicle, we got completely drenched. But because the lines may show up anytime, we don't want to put down the canvases. Comfort is overrated. Okay. Yep. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
what do they say? You see, we are under this big dark rain cloud, and the edge is over there. And over the edge, we could see the clear sky. Maybe we can drive a few miles and get to that area to avoid the rain. And we can then have lunch in the car before we head back to the camp. Knowing that it's not likely we will find the lions in the rain, as they most likely will just hunker down somewhere, so we start the drive. With the raindrop on my face, it's refreshing. I can't believe we are in such a remote place, away from the crowded city, from any humans. We keep driving, but we don't seem to be able to drive out of that rain cloud. Said. It seems that the rain cloud was following us. Well, story of my life. And now we can't even see the end of the rain cloud anymore. You know what? Let's just have lunch right here in the rain. We may as well wait here and eat and see if we will see any lions later. This is. Maybe the most amazing lunch we're gonna have in this kind of atmosphere. Hearing the rain, I better than any YouTube or Netflix, right? <laughs> okay, so um, so what do you think? I mean, like, do you think this thing is gonna stop anytime soon? Because it looks like it's opening further down there. Yeah. 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 But yeah, I'm looking on my left. There's a big storm down there. Look at that. Oh, just everybody, yeah. look at this. <laughs> crazy, crazy, crazy. That's a good one. Is it recording? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yes. And the sound recording is really good. This one. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Rain or no rain, it really doesn't matter. We are just dust in the wind. We are still drenched, shaking with a bit of hypothermia. Yeah, left, right. The food tastes especially it's good this way. I had a good table. chat with Dula, getting to know yeah, more about his life. He's been a guide for eight years now. So here we are, no internet, no TV, no other humans, just the wilderness, the kopi, the rock. Life can't be better than that. For a brief moment, I can finally forget about stress. After an hour, the rain finally stopped. Since it's a long drive home and there's no sighting of any lions, we pack up and slowly start our drive back. A minute later, Dula slowed down the vehicle. Ah, must be just a rock, he said. He picked up the binocular anyways to check. Lions. A previous experience told me that lions are particularly active right after heavy rain. How could we forget? Well, I have forgotten, but I'm sure that Dula has been watching. We drove forward and saw two brother lions with a female. As the two brothers woke up, one gets up. I love that moment when male lions get up on their feet. With the mane shaking, it feels larger than life. He walked towards his brother and they did a head bump. I love their strong bonding. They start to look around in order to locate the west of the pride and the third brother. Here, one of them was in the distance. You can see him under the belly of the front one. They then start to roar. At that moment, there's an opening in the cloud so the sunlight can shine through, creating a dramatic sky.
the third brother from miles away returned the roar, and they start to walk towards them. We watch them disappear in the vast landscape and start to drive back with a big smile. If you like this video, make sure to check out my encounter with seven lions in crazy rain. Those seven lions are trying to take over the whole area, including the territory of these two brothers you just saw. So fingers crossed, they will be okay. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment below to let me know what you think. See you next time. By the way, this video is brought to you by me. <laughs> so the card is open for my editing workflow class and my photography masterclass. Check the link below. Now see you next time.